my money. You y'all think y'all so ain't on? Like blah blah blah. Louis XIII and it's all on me, nigga. You just bought a shot. Come and copy if you think that you gon' knock me off the top. Uh, uh, she, your wife in the backseat of my brand new foreign car. Whoa, don't act like you forgot. I call it shot, shot, shot. Boom, like blah blah blah. how I straightened my Brazilian water wave hair from Modern Hair Show off of AliExpress.com and then I'm just gonna go over how I feel about it now that it's straightened and cut and styled and all that good stuff and you know tell you guys whether I prefer it in this state or the curly state so stay tuned and thank you for watching I'll see you guys later bye okay guys so for those of you who didn't watch my initial review I definitely recommend going back and watching it just for um, reference to see why I decided to straighten the hair and not wear it in its natural state but really quickly I'm just gonna let you guys know the reason why I decided to straighten it cut it and style it is because the closure piece that was that came with the hair was a complete different texture that please excuse my dog was a a complete different texture than the rest of the hair after I washed the hair the closure piece just did not have the same curl pattern as it did when it was delivered to me the hair looked blown out like when you take a blow dryer and you blow out curly hair that's how the closure looked and even with putting water on it it would just poof right back up and then the rest of the hair had really pretty defined curls so I can't wear the hair like that and I didn't want to take the closure off because summertime is coming and I'm not wearing my natural hair out in the summertime so um yeah I didn't want to take the closure off off. So I was like, you know what, I'm just going to have to straighten it, style it, and work with it. And so that's what, what I did. So right now I'm just going to drop down a video of how the hair straightened. It straightened really well and you'll be able to see that right now. Okay guys, so as you can see, the hair straightens really, really well. Now I'm just going to go over the pros and the cons of this hair. Not too many cons, um, but a lot of pros. The one thing I liked about this hair is while I was trying to straighten the hair, I like to brush out my curls to get it as um, stretched out as possible so it's easier to straighten. And I got no shedding while doing that, which is really rare because usually, typically with curly or loose weight hair, when you brush it out, you are going to get a couple strands. But I got maybe one or two strands and the strands weren't even full strands. They were just like little, you know, PC strands. And I was just really impressed that the hair didn't shed the hair didn't shed after I um, layered it and the hair didn't shed after I wand curled it either. So that was really good. The hair is extremely soft. This is really soft Brazilian hair. And I'm so happy that I was able to straighten it and see and be able to tell the real texture of this hair. Because usually sometimes you can't really tell when the hair is curly. But now that it's straightened, this hair is really, really soft. I would have never guessed that it was this soft when it was in its um, natural state. Not saying it wasn't soft, but um, yeah, this hair is really, really nice. I'm really impressed with this Brazilian hair straight, and I honestly am. Um... And just a disclaimer, I do recommend that curly hair. I'm not saying that I don't recommend the curly hair. That curly hair was really nice. And it was really, it was just really unfortunate that I can't wear it because of the closure. But I definitely recommend that water wave hair. It was beautiful. It wasn't tangling. It wasn't shedding. I wasn't getting any, um... Um, matting in the back I was able to run my hands through it over and over again it was just that little bit of unfortunate events the closure is the reason why I can't wear the hair straight but other than the pros the, con the only con I have with this hair is that while I was straightening the hair not so much when I was wand curling it but when I was straightening it from the wavy state to this 
um, the hair was burning and I don't know if this hair just can't take high heat and I was just like I hope there's not no synthetic pieces of hair in this because that's not cool so what I did was I took some strands and I did the virgin hair test and if you don't know what the virgin hair test is it's when you take a strand of hair and you just light a match or put it on the stove and if the hair burns really really quickly and turns into dust or um, little particles you'll know that it's virgin hair synthetic hair on the other hand when you light it or put it over your stove it burns really slow and it doesn't really turn into ash it kind of just it kind of just like coils and turns like jet black. So if the hair burns really fast and turns into ash, you know it's virgin hair. If the hair burns really slow, then you know it's synthetic. And I did a lot of pieces from all over and I mean it all passed the virgin hair test. And when I was flat ironing it, it smelled like burnt plastic. So I was getting really nervous like, oh my God, I hope that this hair doesn't have synthetic pieces in it. It wasn't my whole head that was doing it. It was just a um, certain pieces but when I was looking down on my sink while I was flat ironing it it was like little particles it wasn't like burnt hair it was more like ash so I was just like maybe this hair just can't take high heat I mean it was almost 500 degrees my flat iron goes up to 450 so maybe that's why but I decided to flat iron it on the highest setting because I didn't want to do a lower setting and then have to keep going over and over the hair so maybe the ha maybe it was just because my flat iron was really really hot that's never happened to me before with any other hair so I don't know but other than that this hair has been doing really good I've only been wearing it in this state for the past day so I can't give you like a complete review and be like oh my god I love this hair but so far this hair is very beautiful I really love that this hair is so freaking soft and I am going to be doing a wand curl tutorial I'm gonna show you guys how I got these wand curls I got a new wand curler it's an eight-in-one wand curler from irresistible me they're the same company that sent me my diamond flat iron and it's uh, when I mean eight in one it comes with eight different attachments so you can achieve different curls different size curls and it's really really great so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to show you on different pieces of hair how the eight different attachments curl and then in the comment box below you guys will tell me which attachment you want me to do my whole head in and I'll do that guys I'll do that guys I'll do that for you guys so thanks for watching and I'll see you guys later bye